Hello, my name is Noah Cadeau. And my name is Cecilia Tarapon. And today we will be taking you on a tour around the school. First, we're going to tour the school office. Before you enter the building, you have to put on a mask and sanitize your hands. School starts at 9 o'clock, but if you do happen to be late, you will come to the office and sign in. If you're ever feeling sick, get permission from a teacher, and then you would come here to bring your parents home. If you seem to have lost something or lost your way, you can come to the office and they can help you find your class or whatever item you have lost. If you have been absent or sick from school, you need to come to the office and give them a note of why you were absent. So this is the science corridor and you can either study single award, double award or OCM. We're going to meet one of our science teachers, Dr. Kirkwood. For burning crisps to find out how much energy there is in four different types of snacks. So we're comparing Pringles or the cheap form of Pringles, normal crisps, tortilla chips and cheesy balls. So we're comparing the four different types. We've already burned Pringles and now we're burning cheesy balls. And to make sure it's a fair test, we're using the same amount of water and the same mass of crisps. So Alex is now moving on to burning the second cheesy ball. And as we can see, when you burn a snack, there's a lot of energy in a snack. And Alex is being very careful because he's making sure as much heat from the snack heats the water inside the tube. Now we have reached the RA department where you can study core RA here, which is compulsory. And I do the GCSE RS religious studies and it's also taken in place in here. This is our language department where you can study French, which is a very interesting subject. This is our math department where you can study either foundation term math or higher term math. And this is one of the key subjects where they will hold extra support classes after school so you can get up to date with any topics you're struggling on. This is the table off where the BTECs are done. You can do ICT or business. And then downstairs you can do technology or construction. This is the technology workshop where we do different practicals. Each year does a different practical. This my practical was to build a chair. I enjoy technology because you can learn so many new things about how different machines work and how you can keep safe. This is the IT or business studies classroom. In IT you learn about the online world and how to create and make your own website. And in business studies it's great to have an in-depth look at those brands that you may use and see how they're able to function the way they do. We are now in the English department where you do GCSE English and you can do English Literature. I've really enjoyed English as you to get in-depth look at personal and creative writing. You also get to do speeches on your favourite topics as well. You are also able to join the debate club where you can express your opinions and have arguments about it. We've now reached the history department where I actually do the subject. You take an in-depth look at Nazi Germany and how Hitler trying to get control of the German people. And you also take an in-depth look at the earlier days of Ireland and Britain. This is the careers department. In careers, you can learn to make a CV along with work placement. Ms. Greenaway is here to help with work placement and link placement and any questions you have. This is the school canteen where you can come and buy hot lunches and refreshments and sit down with your friends. And don't feel as if you're going to be left out of your pack lunches because you also can have your pack lunch here as well. This is Learning for Life more. In LLW you can do three different courses. You can do the GCSE course, the Preparation for Ad Life or PAL, or you can do OCM. Examples of what you'll be learning in LLW is about future financing, and the dangers of taking alcohol and drugs, and effects of mental health and physical health. You'll also be having a look at risk-taking behaviours. This is the art department. In art, you get to 
create a portfolio of all your artwork. You also are able to work with different mediums such as clay or photography. So this is the Prince's Trust Department and it is a very interactive course and it's based on a portfolio. In Prince's Trust you will be learning how to be prepared for life and work. This is the Chi Department and this is one of their classrooms. In this classroom you can study either food and nutrition, child development or health and social care. They sometimes run after school activities such as baking classes. So we have now reached the end of the tour. Hopefully you have a bit more insight into coming to this school. We hope and are excited to welcome you in September.